grade one learners. My name is Ms. Hanin, and I'll be giving you visual art. Let me introduce to you theme three. This theme is central idea, plants sustain life on earth and play a role in people's life. In art, we will have the related concept, structures, form, and colors. We will understand the characteristics of plants. We will be using the IBLP inquiries and knowledgeable. We will use our ATL skills, thinking skills to create and make unexpected or unusual connections between your ideas and the things you will be drawing. First of all, we want to introduce to you shapes. The past theme we learned about geometric shapes and now we want to learn about something called organic shapes. But what are organic shapes? If you look at the image on your left, there are different examples of organic shapes. But what are they? Yes, it's true. You can look at them and discover that flowers and humans, we are made of organic shapes, such as plants also are made of organic shapes. Week one and week two. During these classes, we will be learning about organic shapes. There are two types of shapes. One is organic and one is geometric. If we look at the picture on the left, what is the difference? Yes, it's true. Geometric has corners. Organic has no corners. If we look around us, what are organic shapes that we can see? If you have a tree from your window, you will have discovered that this tree is made of organic shapes. If you can look at the sky and you saw a bird, the bird is made of organic shapes. What is geometric then? If you look around you, if there's something that has corners, then you will find maybe a door or a table. During this weeks, we will be learning how to come up with an artwork using organic and geometric shapes. But we will more focus on geometric shapes. We will draw using pencils and crayons and markers and oil pastel to come up with our own artwork using shapes. During the class, we will be reading and listening a story that is called Big Box of Shapes. Let's see what will they build using shapes. So if we put shapes together, do you think we will have something? Yes, we might have a lot of things. We can put organic and geometric shapes together to come up with a drawing. Things you'll see during the art class. We will be using colors, pencils, oil pastel, or if you would like to call them crayons. I can't wait to see you, grade one learners.